Hey guys, at BV Matson here, a quick video. I'm kind of in like with this product, man. <laughs> I tried it just kind of to try it with zero expectations. And I gotta tell you, CLR and removing rust from crusty exhaust or chrome is pretty darn promising. Take a look at this. I literally worked on this for 30 seconds. 30 seconds, no joke. And it knocked it out like nobody's business. So uh, let's see if it, that was just a fluke, if I hit a light spot or if CLR could be the answer to saving your rusty pipes. So <laughs> first 30 seconds was uh, pretty darn amazing. I'm not gonna lie. So all I did was just drop a little bit on top of it. Just pour just a little bit of CLR. Got a little bin here. Um, so I can kind of dab my steel wool, all right? So I'm using some triple O grade steel wool, all right? Some people will be like, dude, too coarse. <laughs> too coarse, what the hell are you doing? Um, you should be using 4 O or you should be using bronze wool. But uh, not too worried about any kind of scratching because this pipe is going to get wrapped in black exhaust wrap. So not too worried. But before I wrap it, I want to make sure that it's nice and clean. Just going to let the CLR kind of do its work. I'm kind of working this one section here. And I can literally see this melting away before my eyes. Now, this is going to take some time. It's going to take a little bit of elbow grease, but we've never been scared of that before, have we? No. We'll put the time in on our parts. Let's keep dabbing it in the CLR. Remember to rotate your product as you're moving through. And I think some good stuff can happen from this stuff. Calcium lime rust remover. <laughs> the stuff isn't that expensive. Heck of a lot cheaper than evaporust for sure. All right. Well, not necessarily. <laughs> I can remember what I paid for this, um, but it's 128 ounce CLR, $22.99. I guess it all depends where you shop. If you can save a dollar or two on this stuff. Uh, went ahead and checked out the costs on Evaporust, and uh, it's basically the same cost. All right. It's the same cost, $22.95 for the same amount of Evaporust. So no big savings, but I do feel better about using this in this style of application and plus it's just melting away um, and way better smelling <laughs> than the vinegar that we have dealt with before man I hope you guys can see the progress that I've made just in what the last again 30 seconds or so on this pipe it's it's gonna look respectable let's go over to this kind of rusty spot there you can see kind of a before and after of this section that I'm working Drop my steel wool into here. All right. Let's just give it a wipey wipe here and see if we can knock this stuff out. I can go and try some bronze for those of you guys who are like, you know, super, <laughs> you know, against using steel wool on chrome, which I totally understand. Although I do think that, you know, a 4 steel wool is good uh, and light enough for uh, anything you might be doing uh, with show chrome, well, not show chrome, but with a, a chrome piece. I think you can get away with it. But here we go, guys. I'm not doing any edits in this, all right? You guys haven't seen an edit yet because I'm just going to do this section of this pipe using CLR and steel wool. And this thing, most people would probably run for the hills on a pipe like this and say, oh, that's junk, that's junk, that's junk. Don't waste your time. But just in this little amount of time we've spent together here, this is doing some serious, serious damage, man. I'm really curious to see, you know, how this would work on a bunch of other applications. I'm just going to go up here, hit some of this. The CLR is getting a little dirty down in the bottom of the pan. But look at this. It's already so clean that I've already just kind of naturally moved up. <laughs> this is incredible. Just keep working this a little bit. 
I honestly think that we would be able to get this pipe clean by using CLR. All right, guys, let's give this a real wipe. I'm not gonna edit. We're just gonna look at it together. You guys were along for the ride. There's that same section of the pipe that we were working. Need a little bit of work down in here, but look at that. That is freaking night and day, because this is what that pipe looked like before I hit it with the CLR. Oh boy, might have found another weapon for the arsenal. There we go, guys. That's what this looked like before. And guys, this is the fastest video I've ever made. Seriously, I've been working on this hardly at all. Just working this kind of section, this round section of this pipe. I mean, that's what it looked like. And just using a little bit of CLR and some steel wool, getting some remarkable results. Again, I just want to clean this enough, get any rust off of it, so I can wrap this in black wrap exhaust, so uh, the, the cloth exhaust stuff. But I think I'm going to be able to get this clean with the CLR. I just want to put it on your radar, guys. This stuff works. I, I had my doubts. <laughs> I've used it in the household before, you know, cleaning shower heads and, and, and things like that. But uh, never really dawned on me to try CLR for rust removal. And for those of you who have worked on these pipes, these things are, are usually pretty roached, pretty nasty. And man, it just knocks this stuff off. Look, a little bit of CLR was just sitting on the surface here. Actually able to wipe that away with my thumb. So it's pretty cheap too. So, um, man, I think I'm in. I think I'm in on the CLR for rust removal again. What? You gotta be kidding me. <laughs> Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If so, be sure that you subscribe. Also, thumbs up the videos that you enjoy. Leave comments, guys. I love your comments. What have you used CLR on? I'd love to hear about it. Uh, if you haven't already, be sure to join the Keep On Wrenching Facebook group. We've got a great group of people going there. And if you want to learn more, sign up for the e-newsletter. Support the channel. Be sure to go to keeponwrenching.com. I'm floored. I'm floored with this one, man. This is amazing. We'll see you in the next video or live stream.